What's up people and welcome to this video guys and as I promised I'm gonna be reviewing this phone talking a bit about its specs a lot of things which it can do and just things about this phone okay but I'm just gonna say right here in the beginning of this video I don't know a lot of things about phones okay I don't like know what's really good and stuff like that so I'm not really gonna do it like a comparison or anything like that but I will go ahead and talk a bit about the stats and you know things about this phone but I will also if you're really interested in maybe looking to buy a new phone and you want to know specific details about this phone I will go ahead and leave well basically all the details uh, that I can find about this phone in the description so you can go and read it yourself first of all this is how it looks and first of all the design of this phone you know I, I absolutely love how this phone looks I think it looks extremely it looks beautiful and cool at the same time I think they have made a really really cool uh, a design of this phone I also love that it's you know from different lightnings and different angles you can see that it is green you can see that it shines through green and just another thing uh, which I think is cool it's called black shark okay it your phone is called black shark that sounds like some kind of a you know some uh, some final boss but it's your phone okay and that says a lot in my ears at least another thing which I like is that they actually have this uh, RBG glowing thing at the back which you know you can definitely go to flex on people with that okay that's absolutely mad that so this is a gaming phone so obviously it has good stats it has good battery life uh, great you know CPU and stuff like that and uh, like I said before stats will be down in the description if you're gonna read more so we can talk a bit about how the layout is so first of all you have the, the volume buttons here okay and then you have you know like a microphone up here you have two cameras here at the back as well as the flash right there here you have the off and on button as well as a gaming mode yes it actually has a gaming mode so let's see if we can, I can actually want to show this so basically when I flip this see if you can see anything it turns into a gaming mode so basically this is what you will see you can see different games which you have on your phone and basically when you launch one of these games, the phone, the phone will only be focusing on this game. And I think this is really cool, it actually has a specific button for a gaming mode. So you can turn it off and on, just like that. It's really, really cool. I absolutely think it's a really, really cool feature and a creative way to have, you know, add an extra button on the side. It does not have any audio out port, but you do get a, a dongle which you can connect to your AUX uh, cable so you can listen to music and stuff like that. And you know, phones are going in that direction, so uh, it's just time to get used to it. Another microphone down here. It's using liquid cooling, which uh, it's definitely, I've never really heard any other phone using that. So that is definitely really unique to this phone. It has two different versions, one with 168 gigabyte and one with 256 gigabyte maybe there's another version with even more storage I'm not completely sure okay I will have a link in the description as well to uh, where you can buy these phones where you can go to find even more stats and from what I can read right here you can also go to record with, with 4k which just blows my mind that's really awesome so if you want to go to know even more stats about this phone like I said before it will be down in the description or just click the link but now I'm just going to talk a bit about some features of this phone and one thing which you maybe noticed when I was talking about the buttons and stuff like that uh, on the phone maybe you noticed that there isn't any fingerprint scanner do you know why because the fingerprint scanner is actually right here on the screen which I think is just absolutely insane so but you just place your finger right there on the screen and to unlock it which I think is just absolutely mad now what the crap that's insane so other cool features which this phone actually has is when you're playing a game like I said before you can go into gaming mode but you also have this feature where you can basically you can scroll down this thing and you get a lot of different options so I'm recording this right here on the screen so you can see it right there so you can go and get uh, attach a gamepad it also has a feature called monster touch which is basically when you press a bit harder on the screen you can go to make it do different things and this is really cool for like PUBG Mobile for example so basically if I press a bit harder on this side I can press a button anywhere in this uh, on this side of the uh, screen right here 
And so basically if I press a bit harder on the bottom right here, it will go ahead and do press up here, which I think is really, really cool. So basically, if you want to go to an aim and you can go and switch the aim button up here, you can go and use hard press down there and it will automatically make it like you're clicking up there instead. You can make it on both sides. I think this is a really cool feature and will definitely get more implemented into gaming on mobile in the future. You can also go to turn out, turn off notifications and keypad. Uh, you can go ahead and make it so no one can call you, you can go to clear RAM uh, and a lot of different things. You even have settings right here so you can optimize things in the game. You can see frame rate right here, increase the frame rate, uh, a lot of different things right here. So there you have some features in the phone, it has even more features but the video will be too long if we just keep talking about a lot of features. The last thing which I wanted to talk about is how the box looks. So this is how the box looks when you're getting it. And it comes with a few different things. Okay, first of all, so you obviously get the phone, okay, um, we, we know that, okay, but you also get this bad boy. And what is this? It is a case for your phone. And it is, uh, well, it's kind of like a gaming case. It's, you know, you just slide it in. It's very simple to just get in there. And it's, you know, I think it's um, silicone, so it's very good grip on it, which I think is just great for gaming on your phone and stuff like that, because you don't want to have sharp edges or your slippery phone when you're playing, because it's easy to drop it and it's very uncomfortable. And that is why you can go and just place this on. And it's just great that this actually comes along with the box. I never really seen any other phone ever down do something like this, you know, giving you a case and then you get the normal usual stuff, the charger and the other usual things. But guys, that was all for this video, comment down below what you think about this gaming phone. I think it's really, really cool and if you want to check it out, like I said, links will be in the description as well as more information about the phone. But I hope I'll see you in the next video, but as always, thank you for watching.